Section 17 of English Synonyms and Antonyms. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Mario Pineda. English Synonyms and Antonyms by James Champlain Fernald. Character to clear. Character. Synonyms. Constitution. Disposition. Genius. Nature. Personality. Record reputation, spirit, temper, temperament. Character is what one is, reputation what he is thought to be. His record is the total of his known action or inaction. As a rule, a man's record will substantially express his character. His reputation might be higher or lower than his character or record will justify. Repute is a somewhat formal word with the same general sense as reputation. One's nature includes all his original endowments or propensities, Character includes both natural and acquired traits. We speak of one's physical constitution as a strong or weak, etc., and figuratively always with the adjective of his mental or moral constitution. Compare characteristic. Prepositions. The witness has a character for veracity. His character is above suspicion. The character of the applicant. Characteristic. Synonyms. Attribute. Character. Distinction. Feature. Indication. Mark. Peculiarity property, quality, sign, singularity, trace, trait. A characteristic belongs to the nature or character of the person, thing, or class, and serves to identify an object, as a copper-colored skin, high cheekbones, and straight black hair are characteristics of the American Indian. A sign is manifest to an observer. A mark or a characteristic may be more difficult to discover. An insensible person may show signs of life, while sometimes only close examination will disclose marks of violence. Pallor is ordinarily a mark of fear, but in some brave natures it is simply a characteristic of intense earnestness. Mark is sometimes used in a good, but often in a bad sense. We speak of the characteristic of a gentleman, the mark of a villain. Compare attribute, character. Charming. Synonyms. Bewitching, captivating, delightful, enchanting, enrapturing, entrancing, fascinating, winning. That is, charming or bewitching, which is adapted to win others as by a magic spell. Enchanting, enrapturing, entrancing represents the influence as to not only supernatural, but irresistible and delightful. That which is fascinating may win without the lightning, drawing by some unseen power as a serpent its prey. We can speak of horrible fascination. Charming applies only to what is external to oneself. Delightful may apply to personal experiences or emotions as well. We speak of a charming matter, a charming dress, but of delightful anticipations. Compare amiable, beautiful. Chasten. Synonyms. Afflict, castigate, chastise, correct, discipline, humble, punish, purify, refine, soften, subdue, try. Castigate and chastise refer strictly to corporal punishment, though both are somewhat archaic. Correct and punish are often used as euphemisms in preference to either. Punish is distinctly retributive in sense. Chastise, partly retributive and partly corrective. Chasten, wholly corrective. Chasten is used exclusively in the spiritual sense and chiefly of the visitation of God. Prepositions. We are chastened of the Lord. 1 Corinthians 11, 32. They chastened us after their own pleasure, but he for our profit. Hebrews 12, 10. Chasten in thy hot displeasure. Psalms 4, 7 chastened with pain by trials and sorrows cherish synonyms cheer cling to comfort encourage entertain foster harbor hold dear nourish nurse nurture protect shelter treasure value to cherish is both to hold dear and to treat as dear mere unexpressed esteem will not be cherishing in the marriage bow to love honor and cherish the word cherish implies all that each can do by love and tenderness for the welfare and happiness of the other, as by support, protection, care in sickness, comfort in sorrow, sympathy, and help of every kind. To nurse is to tend the helpless or feeble as infants or the sick or wounded. To nourish is strictly to sustain and build up by food. To nurture includes careful mental and spiritual training, with something of love and tenderness. To foster is simply to maintain and care for, to bring up. A foster child will be nourished, but may not be as tenderly nurtured or as lovingly cherished as if one's own. 
in the figurative sense the opinion one cherishes he holds not with mere cold conviction but with loving devotion antonyms see synonyms for abandon chasten choose synonyms call elect pick pick out prefer select prefer indicates a state of desire and approval choose an act or will prudence or generosity may lead one to choose what he does not prefer select implies a careful consideration of the reasons for preference and choice among objects so nearly alike that we have no reason to prefer any one to another we may simply choose the nearest but we could not be said to select it aside from theology elect is popularly confined to the political sense as a free people elect their own rules call from the latin colligere commonly means to collect as well as to select in a garden we call the choicest flowers antonyms cast away cast out decline disclaim dismiss leave refuse reject repudiate throw aside prepositions choose from or from among the number choose out of the army choose between or betwixt two among many choose for the purpose circumlocution synonyms diffuseness periphrasis pleonasm prolixity redundance redundancy surplusage tautology tediousness verbiage verbosity wordiness circumlocution and periphrasis are roundabout ways of expressing thought circumlocution is the more common periphrasis the more technical word constant circumlocution produces an affected and heavy style occasionally skillful periphrasis conduces both to beauty and to simplicity etymologically diffuseness is a scattering both of words and thought redundancy is an overflow prolixity goes into endless pity details without selection or perspective pleonasm is the expression of an idea already plainly implied tautology is the restatement in other words of an idea already stated or a useless repetition of a word of words pleonasm may add emphasis tautology is always a fault i saw it with my eyes is a pleonasm all the members agree unanimously is tautology verbiage is the use of mere words without thought verbosity and wordiness denote an excess of words in proportion to the thought tediousness is the sure result of any of these faults of a style antonyms brevity compactness compression conciseness condensation directness plainness shortness succinctness terseness circumstance synonyms accompaniment concomitant detail event fact feature incident item occurrence particular point position situation a circumstance latin circum around and sto stand is something existing or occurring in connection with or relation to some other fact or event modifying or throwing light upon the principal matter without affecting its essential character an accompaniment is something that unites with the principal matter though not necessary to it as the piano accompaniment to a song a concomitant goes with a thing in natural connection but in a subordinate capacity or perhaps in contrast as cheerfulness is a concomitant of virtue a circumstance is not strictly nor usually an occasion condition effect or result see these words under cause nor is the circumstance properly an incident see under accident we say my decision will depend upon circumstances not upon incidents that a man wore a blue necktie will not probably be the cause occasion condition or concomitant of his committing murder but it may be a very important circumstance to identifying him as the murderer all the circumstances make up this situation a certain disease is the cause of a man's death his suffering is an incident that he is his own home that he has good medical attendance careful nursing etc are consolatory circumstances with the same idea of subordination we often say this is not a circumstance to that so a person is said to be in easy circumstances compare event prepositions mere situation is expressed by in the circumstances action affected is performed under the circumstances class synonyms association caste circle clan clique club company coterie grade order rank set a class is a number or body of persons or objects having common pursuits purposes attributes or characteristics a caste is hereditary a class may be independent of lineage or descent membership in a caste is supposed to be for life membership in a class may be very transient 
a religious and ceremonial sacredness attaches to the caste as not to the class the rich and the poor form separate classes yet individuals are constantly passing from each to the other the classes in a college remain the same but their membership changes every year we speak of rank among hereditary nobility or military offices of various orders of the priesthood by accommodation we may refer in a general way to the higher ranks the lower orders of any society grade implies some regular scale or valuation and some inherent qualities for which a person or thing is placed higher or lower in the scale as the coarser and finer grades of wool a man of an inferior grade a coterie is a small company of persons of similar tastes who meet frequently in an informal way rather for social enjoyment than for a serious purpose clique has always an unfavorable meaning a clique is always fractional implying some greater gathering of which it is a part the association breaks up into cliques persons unite in a coterie through simple liking for one another they withdraw into a clique largely through aversion or to outsiders a set while exclusive is more extensive than a clique and chiefly of persons who are united by common social station etc circle is similar in meaning to set but of wider application we speak of scientific and religious as well as of social circles prepositions a class of merchants the senior class at sometimes of harvard the classes in college cleans synonyms brush clean disinfect dust lave mop purify rinse scour scrub sponge sweep wash wipe to clean is to make clean by removing dirt impurities or soil of any kind cleans implies a worse condition to start from and more to do than clean hercules cleans the ogen stables cleans is especially applied to purifying processes where liquid is used as in the flushing of a street etc we brush clothing if dusty sponge it or sponge it off if soiled or sponge off a spot furniture books etc are dusted floors are mopped or scrubbed metallic utensils are scoured a room is swept soiled garments are washed foul air or water is purified cleans and purify are used extensively in a moral sense wash in that sense is archaic compare amend antonyms befoul besmear besmirch bespatter contaminate corrupt debase defile deprave pollute soil spoil stain sully taint vitiate prepositions cleans off or from physical or moral defilement cleans with an instrument by an agent the room was cleansed by the attendants with soap and water clear synonyms apparent diaphanous distinct evident explicit intelligible limpid lucid manifest obvious pellucid perspicuous plain straightforward translucent transparent unadorned unambiguous unequivocal unmistakable clear latin clarus bright brilliant primarily refers to that which shines and impresses the mind through the eye with a sense of luster or splendor a substance is said to be clear that offers no impediment to vision is not dim dark or obscure transparent refers to the medium through which a substance is seen clear to the surface itself without reference to anything to be seen through it we speak of a stream as clear when we think of the water itself we speak of it as transparent with reference to the ease with which we see the pebbles at the bottom clear is also said of that which comes to the senses without dimness dullness obstruction or obscurity and so that there is no uncertainty as to its exact form character or meaning with something of the brightness or brilliancy implied in the primary meaning of the word clear as the outlines of the ship were clear against the sky a clear view a clear note clear as a bell a clear frosty air a clear sky a clear statement hence the word is used for that which is free from any kind of obstruction as a clear field lucid and pellucid refer to a shining clearness as of crystal a transparent body allows the forms and colors of objects beyond to be seen through it a translucent body allows light to pass through but may not permit forms and colors to be distinguished plate glass is transparent ground glass is translucent limpid refers to a liquid clearness or that which suggests it as limpid streams that which is distinct is well defined especially in outline each part or object standing or seeming apart from any order not confused indefinite or blurred distinct enunciation enables the hearer to catch every word or vocal sound without perplexity or confusion a distinct statement is free from indefiniteness or ambiguity 
a distinct apprehension of a thought leaves the mind in no doubt or uncertainty regarding it that is plain in the sense here considered which is as it were level to the thought so that one goes straight on without difficulty or hindrance as plain language a plain statement a clear explanation perspicuous is often equivalent to plain but plain never wholly loses the meaning of unadorned so that we can say the style is perspicuous though highly ornate though we could not call it at once ornate and plain compare evident antonyms ambiguous cloudy dim dubious foggy indistinct mysterious obscure opaque turbid unintelligible vague prepositions clear to the mind clear in argument clear of or from annoyances end of section seventeen